Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are doing part 3 of AEW Fight Forever Road to Elite. Last episode ended the same way the first episode did. Uh, ended the end of the episode and I lost. I'm not happy about it. Like I don't I don't I don't like tag matches. If y'all saw in the last episode, it's just tag matches are weird. It's I'll I'll give credit to WWE. Like their tag matches are a lot easier. You can stun your opponent and they don't come back up. And in this, like the opponent's always back up. And Christian was not doing anything to stop Cassidy from uh, interfering and breaking up the pin. And Aubrey Edwards counts so slow. How do you? How do you? It's supposed to be like a one, two, three. But instead, she's like one, two, three. It's like it's just a little bit slower than I wanted to. But now our stamina is at 43 of 100. We're not injured, and our I'm guessing that's momentum or morale. But it's at normal. I'm going to go out to eat, build that up, and that'll put us back at 100. Island Storm Restaurant in Austin. Here's your Tex-Mex platter. Oh, I just remembered I didn't go eat in Los Angeles, so I don't know what they had over there. Thanks. So what's the difference between Tex-Mex and traditional Mexican food anyway? Good question. It's mostly the ingredients. Things like yellow cheese, flour, and lettuce aren't typical in Mexican cuisine. Enjoy. Let's eat. Again, with the chewing. Ugh. Ion Storm in Texas. I just said in Texas. Ion Storm in Austin. This player represents the best collaboration Texas and Mexico has ever produced. Creamy and spicy and guaranteed to have you running for more. <laughs> uh. Oh, Ray Phoenix. Kenny Omega, I saw you enjoying some Tex-Mex and wanted to talk to you. You know Death Triangle is like Brit Mex. We're perfectly blend British and Lucha Libre styles. You and your new partner are a bad combo. How about you give us more than one match before you compare us to you and your literal brother, okay? Fair enough, amigo. But remember, bad teams don't last. Well, I'm waiting for me and Christian to go at it one-on-one -on -one again because I don't really want to... I don't want a team. I don't like teams. I want to... I want to fight. Okay. Stamina is at 100. So let's go out. Let's go sightseeing again. Build that up, and we should be at excellent. Outdoor art gallery in, Ox in Austin, Texas. What? I don't see an art gallery. Artists, when given a chance, can make something really special. Me, being an AEW, that's my chance to make something special of my own. We were just looking at buildings. I'm, I'm confused. Okay. Uh, what happens if we go out? Press conference? Do we need to do a press conference? I don't know. Uh, I might do a press conference just because of this. Oh, are these like important things or like little side quests? Press conference and... Okay. I didn't set up to team with someone who, for all intents and purposes, is my rival band. AEW, you never know what's going to happen. At Dynamite, me and my new partner will face a bona fide dream team. But the world needs to wake up and realize they're looking at the next AEW Tag Team Champs. So don't miss the match, Texas. I... I didn't need to do that. I thought that was something important. I guess not. Oh. I won my share of tag team titles, six or so, with almost as many different partners. So what's the secret to a successful tag team? You have to accentuate your partner's strengths and hide their weaknesses and get separate hotel rooms. <laughs> Thanks for the advice. And a pick. I got... So did I... I think I missed one last episode. I saw an exclamation mark. I don't think I capitalized on it. Yeah, well, let's go. I'm gonna have to get like everybody's picture, like maybe next time through. Let's see, we're good on everything. I don't think we 
Do you know you think of the shop? I, I have not bought any of the shirts. Is it bad that I just don't buy any of the shirts? I'm gonna go ahead and go into Dynamite. Yeah, I just wanna go ahead and go into the match now. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. It's a tag match, player. Kenny Omega versus Kenny Omega and Christian versus Sting and the former Big Show. Omega! Yeah. And his tag team partner, Christian King. Wait a minute. He didn't get the another loss on his record after I beat him. He didn't get the loss in the tag match. So. Yeah, no more Big Show. No more BS. I'm not losing this time. Can you... Stop it. I don't like the interference crap. Get up from this, Sting. I'm all, I already hit you. Either. Okay. I'm not doing any damage to him. I don't know why I, I... This could be a lot harder to take down Big Show. I'm not calling him Paul White even though I probably should. It's just... V trigger you again. Ooh, elbow drop. I don't know what Christian's doing, but I'm gonna just go ahead and I, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm lifting my knee up, y'all. I don't know if that's gonna do me any good. I'm gonna emo in the ring. Wait, there's no count outs. Oh, no way. I'm gonna hit a one and we're gonna enter on the outside to the big show. I don't know what we're doing. Get him in the ring. Can you? Christian. Dude. We gotta win the match and we're not gonna win by count out. Okay, can y'all get in the ring now? Y'all are still going after Christian.
I'm trying to figure this out. Okay. Come on. I had faith in this. Why? Well, no one's chanting fight forever. Why is no one chanting fight forever? Christian. Get him in the ring. Oh my god, Christian. Oh, well, ooh, that can't be good. Oh, come on. I'm trying to stop him from... Uh, this fight's gonna take forever. This, this one might be the whole episode, y'all. No way. Good God. Yo, we are getting... Snapdragon? Could change the target. Oh, come on, Christian. Maybe we will actually finish this match. Never mind. Christian, stop getting involved. Stop getting involved. Like, you're not the legal man anyway. Come on. Ah, uh, what's going on with the ropes? What is going on with the ropes? Oh boy. How is this the longest tag match ever? Now this should be it. Oh, probably not. Probably not. His foot's on the ropes. Christian. Just stop. Just, just stop for a second. Ah, I got, and now I gotta reverse it. Eh, I can't reverse crap. Christian, you are getting in the way of the entire thing. What? <sighs> oh my god. Sting needs to stop. Come on. Y'all, this is gonna be probably episode three as it is. Like, I don't even know if I'll be able to continue on to another match on 
next week's Dynamite. This is the longest match I've ever played. Okay, Christian, you stay out of my way. Oh boy. Powerbomb V trigger. Okay, okay. What? Y'all saw that, right? Christian just left me high and dry. He went, he got in the ring and then got back out. What are they saying? What? That was not a rope break. Ah! I hate the targeting. I hate the targeting. Sting, get out of the ring. Why? Why is Christian in here? I can't reverse. I cannot reverse. You know what? Maybe I should just give Christian the... Because <sighs> if Paul's a little health, we could probably just move him over to the... Come on. This is annoying. Maybe one more time. Cause Sting's not doing or er, not Sting. Chris is not doing anything. We could try and hit it. Stein. I'm a, oh. <sighs> I'm gonna try and pin him after this, y'all, but I have I have whole loads of doubt. Let's go! We got the win. Uh, I just had to drag him far enough away from Sting. Uh, that was annoying. A great win for these two against a truly legendary team. 
But the world is starting to take notice of Kenny and Christian. Well, are they? I mean, really. But we got the victory. Whew. Like, it's so annoying, the the reversals and stuff. But just the team members constantly getting in the ring and no consequences being added. Just, just like, oh, we're just going to allow it. Airport baggage claim. Do we lose our luggage again? It's been two hours. If I don't leave now, I'm going to miss the last shuttle. If I don't even have my gear, I hope they find my bag. Who keeps taking my lug? Someone's taking my luggage. Right? Like, someone's gotta be the one taking my. Like, there's gotta be someone specifically taking my luggage. You might want to use an item before an important match. In the shop, you can use career money or for matches to recover energy or gain other buffs. Going to the shop will not. Use up a turn, be sure to drop it whenever the road gets tough. It's already tough as it is. But this is where we're going to leave it. Our record is now 2-2. Two and two. We're ending this episode on a win for once instead of a loss. Uh, next week, after this, after part 4, is going to be the pay-per-view match. We may be able to get it in next episode, but uh, we got this week and then... We got the pay-per-view, which I don't know what's going to be next. Uh, but I'm having fun with it. I'm having to spam the reversals. The kick-out stuff for the pins is a little bit rough because I'm only able to like smash down two of the buttons, like, like constantly spam it. So it's a little difficult. But overall, it is a good game. It's like it's got its moments of like, okay, this is like, this is irritating. This is annoying. How we can I get past it? Like, it's kind of has those moments where you're just kind of angry at your controller or just at the game, like for why it's not working right. But it it does work uh, the rest of the time, so I'll give it credit for that. Um, with that being said, thank you all for watching. Uh, if y'all enjoyed this episode, leave a like down below. Uh, Comment uh, down what other games you might want to see, what uh, what kind of matches you want me to play, and just leave something nice down in the comments below. Uh, if you aren't subscribed, please subscribe. It, it helps the channel out. Um, yeah. So thank you all for watching, and have a nice day.